solid vapor equilibrium. We can explain this by the example of sublimation of iodine. If we place solid iodine in a closed vessel, after some time the vessel gets filled up with violet vapors and the intensity of color increases with time. After certain time, the intensity of color becomes constant and at this stage equilibrium is attained. Hence, solid iodine sublimes to give iodine vapors and iodine vapors condenses to give solid iodine. This equilibrium can be represented as I2 solid in equilibrium with I2 vapor. Other examples are camphor solid in equilibrium with camphor vapor, NH4Cl solid in equilibrium with NH4Cl vapor. Equilibrium involving dissolution of solids in liquids. In saturated solutions, a dynamic equilibrium exists between solute molecules and the solution. For example, sugar solution in equilibrium with sugar solid and the rate of dissolution of sugar equals to rate of crystallization of sugar. Equilibrium involving dissolution of gases in liquids. In a soda water, the equilibrium is CO2 gas in equilibrium with CO2 in solution. According to Henry's law, the mass of a gas dissolved in a given mass of a solvent at any temperature is proportional to pressure of the gas above the solvent. Hence, when a soda water bottle is open, some of the CO2 carbon dioxide gas dissolved in it escapes out rapidly to reach a new equilibrium state required for the liver pressure. General characteristics of equilibrium involving physical process. 1. Equilibrium is possible only in a closed system at a given temperature. 2. Both the opposite processes occur at the same rate and there is a dynamic but stable condition achieved. 3. All measurable properties of the system remains constant. 4. When equilibrium is attained for a physical process, one of its parameters becomes constant. For example, Observe the following table. Process Conclusion Liquid in equilibrium with vapor H2O liquid in equilibrium with H2OG pH2O constant at a given temperature. Solid in equilibrium with liquid H2O solid in equilibrium with H2O liquid melting point is fixed at constant pressure solute in equilibrium with solution sugar S in equilibrium with sugar solution concentration of a solute in a solution is constant at a given temperature gas G in equilibrium with gas aqueous co2 g in equilibrium with co2 aqueous the ratio of concentration of dissolved gas and undissolved gas is constant at a given temperature